Content creators have come up with many ways to transition from one video to another while retaining the meaning and being visually interesting. Every time we watch famous YouTubers, it seems to us that the transitions they use are possible only with advanced programs and huge experience in video editing. But the reality is different. Almost anyone can easily create memorable and visually stunning effects, and Mobavi Video Suite will help us with that. An accessible and intuitive program combines video editing, screen recording, and conversion tools. Today I will show you five cool transition effects that will take no more than five minutes to create. Remember, you just need to start. You can learn how to work with the platform along the way because this app is designed for both beginners and more advanced users. We should start with something super simple, whip pen, or as they call it, swoosh. This effect is especially popular in the YouTube community. One wave of the hand, a short animation, and we are watching something entirely new. First, let's open Movavi Video Suite. Next, you need to create a new empty project. Now let's add the video files. To do this, click on Add Files and select the footage. In addition to video files, we can also add pictures or sound effects. Okay, the files have been added. What's next? Just drag and drop files onto the timeline like this. The timeline is intuitive and allows you to quickly organize clips within a project, split them into multiple tracks and link or unlink clips between them. You can edit manually using scissors and drag and drop, but the program allows for effortlessly automating the process. Okay, the video with me waving my hands needs to be shortened slightly. To do this, we can click on the scissors icon or simply drag the right edge to the center until we reach the desired length. Now my video ends after the wave of the hand. Perfect. However, there is no transition transition between the videos themselves, just a simple cut. To create the effect, we're going for click on transitions, and transitions are the most important tool for structuring videos, and there are hundreds of them in Mobile Video Suite. They do not only separate the semantic parts of the video, but also make the video even more expressive. In the list of effects, look for offset and drag it to the timeline. The program will automatically highlight the junction of two video files on the timeline with a gray rectangle Let's see how it looks. Not bad, but the default transition length is too big for our purposes. Let's reduce it a bit. To do this, we can double click on the transition and in the transition duration, enter a smaller value or simply drag the borders of the transition to the center. Okay, now we're talking. The duration is spot on. To enhance the effect even further, we should also add an audio effect. I have already imported it to the program earlier, so I just drag it to the timeline. In the green rectangle of this effect, we can see how its volume changes. The peak needs to be synchronized with our transition, adjust its position and speed it up a little to better match the transition. Our swoosh must be fast. Double click on the audio track and change speed to 200. And let's look at the results. Fast, stylish and modern transition effect in under two minutes. The second effect is also very simple and its algorithm is very similar to the previous one. I'm not sure whether this effect has its name or not, but let's call it a planetary teleport. It's great for showcasing travel in a fast, expressive way. This effect works especially well in cases where you have a drone, but I will show it using the video samples. Import the files and drag them in the correct sequence onto the timeline. We instantly notice that the length of the video in the middle is excessive. We want to be fast, dynamic, so waiting five seconds isn't an option. Double click on the video and change change the speed to 500. Better, but not what we're looking for. Let's increase the speed to 800%. Now let's go to transitions. We need two effects, fast zoom out and fast zoom in. Drag and drop the first effect between the first video and the second, and the second effect between the second and third videos. Let's look at what we have now. Okay, but the effects are too slow. Double click on each and reduce the duration to about 0.8 seconds. Okay, much better now. If you want to make the effect even better, you can add the sound effect of swoosh to each transition. With the sound effects, this transition really shines. The camera quickly zooms out from the object and zooms into a new location. Now export the final video by clicking on export. As you can see, video editing with the Movavi Video Suite is a piece of cake. The app has just received a huge update that brought a ton of new exciting features, effects, artificial intelligence, improved optimization. Video editing becomes easier and more convenient every day. Let your creativity take effect with the new video suite. In addition to five new frames, we're giving you an exclusive pack of effects for YouTube at no charge, just because 
because we love you. Try them out in your next hit. AI upscaling will help you make your videos even better, give what you've shot a serious facelift and make your vid's resolution eight times higher. Recording scheduler won't let you miss your favorite live streams. Your longtime favorite scheduled recordings are back on the menu. Drawing shapes on video will come in handy while recording your tutorials. Add tidy looking pointers and other shapes in the middle of your recordings. Guide the viewer's attention to the parts you want to highlight and get your message across in an impactful way. AI background removal will help you waste less time on creating even more stunning effects. Use the power of AI to instantly swap out backgrounds in your videos with no need for green screens. Drop in a new vibrant scene and get ready for an avalanche of likes on YouTube. AI noise removal will cut through the noise if you filmed your video outdoors, remove car, wind, and other uncool sounds from your videos with this new AI-driven audio denoiser. The list of additions goes on and on, but why read about them when you can try them out yourself? Subscribe to Movavi Video Suite and get all these cool features and some more for a whole year. Hit the link down below to use this special offer from our secret page. The third effect involves not only the tricks from the previous two transitions, but also something new. Stickers. First, let's import the files and drag the first video to the timeline. Now we must create an additional video track. This is done by clicking on this icon. Now drag the second video on both of these tracks. However, the newly created video track, it must be trimmed a bit by dragging the left edge to the right. Next, open the tab with transitions and select gradient. Drag it in between the two videos. The effect already looks good, but we will go further and make it even more stylish. Click on the stickers and search for the airplane sticker. Just drag the one you like to the timeline. We must animate it so it won't stay in the middle of the frame the entire time. Click on the purple rectangle of the sticker on the timeline twice and then rotate the sticker to match the direction of our transition. Now right click and select tools, animation. Next click on advanced, two dots have emerged. These dots are the keyframes and they indicate the start and end of the animation. Adjust their position so that the animation lasts as long as the transition. Now click on the first point and drag the sticker left to determine the starting position. Next, click on the second dot and mark the final position of the sticker by dragging it to the right. After some minor adjustment to the effect length, we have this. Elegant, stylish, and trendy. What do you think? In this video, I'm showing that creative effects can be done even with only standard functionality. But don't forget that the app has the effects store with numerous packs for each occasion. These packs will make transitions, animations, effects, and overall editing even cooler. The fourth effect will be a tiny bit more complicated. For its creation, we'll use pictures with a transparent background. I have already found and downloaded the necessary pictures from the internet and imported the files. Here is my idea. Each boy's punch will fill part of the screen with comic-like effect, and the transition will happen after the screen is fully covered with these pictures. Drag the first video to the timeline, each picture must have a separate video track. Now to make things easier, let's add markers to each hit. Watch the video, pause after the blow is landed, right-click on the timeline and select Add Marker. I will only do four hits and just trim the rest of the video. Next, you need to drag each image onto its individual track, the previously created markers will help us position them correctly. After adding each effect, correct its position in the frame. Now add a second video to the main timeline. Go to the transitions and select fade to black. This transition is needed to hide the cut between videos. It will happen underneath the layers with images and won't really be seen. Synchronize the disappearing of all images and you're done. If you wish, you can add a fade in effect to each picture. Here's what the final result looks like. I think that it looks very decent for a two-minute effect. The last transition is also very easy to pull off. For this transition, you need to download the green screen blinking effect. Here's my idea. One blink and the shot has changed. Import files and create two additional video sequences. Place the first video on the bottom timeline, the second video in the center, and the blinking effect on the top. By default, all videos start from zero and cannot be dragged to a random place. To fix this, 
click on this small chain link icon. Now each video file can freely move along the timeline, drag the second video to the end position of the first one and the blinking effect on the moment of transition. Next, we need to get rid of the green background. Right click, tools, chroma key. The program will automatically see the green and delete it. Movavi Video Suite Chroma Key opens up numerous possibilities for creativity. It is great not only for replays in the background, but also for creating special effects. And setting it up in Movavi Video Suite is much easier than in any professional program. I wish I could say that we're done, but the effect file is smaller than the other videos. We need to make it larger. Right-click again and in Tools, select Crop and Rotate. Adjust the size of the grid, one thing left to do is to sync the blinking with the cut. Hold Command or Control and scroll to enlarge the timeline. Adjust the position and check out the results. Personally, I really like this effect. As you see, creating transitions is easy when you have such a versatile tool. Movavi Video Suite is synonymous for fast and easy video editing. Well shot footage gets even better when you assemble all clips into one coherent story. Try Movavi and see for yourself that you can create fantastic videos without breaking a sweat. And see you next week.